Greetings, programs. This is Wretch, and welcome back to Gemini Rue. We're here in Matthias' apartment, and we gotta find a way to not get shot. Matthias Howard. There you are. Come out. We know you're in there. Matthias Howard, we know who you are. Uh, and we still can't get through the cabinet, right? That's not big enough to hide in. And we can't go out to the balcony. Are we sure? That's not big. Right, let's try the try the kitchen again. I don't need to look. There's nowhere to hide here. They'd spot me in an instant. Well, the balcony just didn't really. Uh oh. Freeze. Hi. And you'll shoot me too. Good to know. So what do we do? Let's take a long look here at the apartment. We got pictures, we got the cabinet. We'll be shot the second that we go through the balcony door. There's the kitchen. Um let's call Kane. Okay. Yes. Number not found. Uh oh. Um. Well, we can try and. Close the door. Over here. Yeah. That door is broken. Oh. You think he went out that way? We probably knew we were coming. Let's move out. He's probably still around here. We should start combing the city. Okay, cool. We just weren't fast enough that last time. It's clear. I thought we had got shot across okay. the way. Looks like the body Okudu knew about our extraction. They just cleared out Matthias's apartment. Check the communication codes for my current location. Got anything? Got something. Yep, it looks like the body Okudu, but I'm not sure. What's going on here? I don't know, but it looks like Matthias left here a long time ago. I'll try to contact him and see if they're still in the city. So are we still doing this extraction or not? I'll get back to you. Matthias has to have some kind of contact information in there somewhere. I've got to call him and find out where he is. Okay. Good, that makes sense, because when we got out of here in the last episode, I thought that they were actually over here and they had shot us, but I guess I was just in front of the door for too long. I was like, snipers, they were waiting on us. Well, let's use the home console. Might be able to find a number there. Profile, maybe? All right, 35 years old, PH engineer. No entries found in the journal. We got the standard map. All right, cool. Let's make a call. Hello? Matthias. It's Azrael. What happened to our meeting? Azrael? How did you get this number? What happened? You didn't show. Azrael, I don't have time. If I don't get out of the city... Where are you? I'm... Do you remember where we were stationed during the war? What? The Winchester building. Do you remember it? It's been ten years. No, I don't remember it. Meet me behind it in ten minutes. What about my brother? Where is he? Matthias. The Winchester building. I'll be there in ten minutes. Matthias! Click. Kane. Still here. I need directions to the Winchester building. What's going on? I've got thirty minutes. I'll see you then. Azrael out. Interesting. 
Flashback? Hopefully. That's the last time I'll have to drag a sorry carcass in here. He's not dead. I know. Come on, let's get out of here. Delta Six, hurry, wake up. I'm gonna try to get you out of here. I found out what the director's doing. This is not what we're supposed to be doing to you all. I'll try to help you get your memory back. Welcome to the Rehabilitation Center for... Sadly, we've wasted enough time, so... I don't have the time or nerve to listen to that automated tape again. Hello again. My name is the director. Hi. Delta Six. Wake up, will you? Thank you. I really, really don't understand why you have to put me in this frustrating position to have to recondition you all over again. Do you realize how far you've set back your training by trying to escape and having your memory wiped again? It's like THX 1138. Do you understand anything that I'm saying? Please tell me they didn't erase your vocal functions. I specifically told them only to do the non-cognitive wipe. Please say something, anything. A simple word would suffice. Oh, I could think of a few. I have the speaker. What do... I have a map? Okay, that's... I... that's interesting. I've got a door. Not a thing, huh? How about this door? We'll talk to the director as a last resort here. And I think that time has come. Y yes? All right, Delta Six. Glad to see you back in functioning order. Oh. Let's get back to your training again, which you have so hastily discarded. This might be um, Azriel's or Azil's uh, brother that he's trying to find. Some of the other instructors were worried that we erased your cognitive functions along with your memory banks. It does occasionally happen, so they wanted you to retake some simple logic tests. But logic tests are such a bore, and you look fine to me. Don't you agree, Delta Six? I'll take that as a yes. So, let's get back to the fun bit of your training. Before your unfortunate escape attempt, we were training you in the finer aspects of the handgun. Let's see if you can still remember how to do it. Go ahead, pick up your new toy. Would you kindly? We got a grate there. Grate leads into a drain. We got a security camera there. I always feel like somebody's watching me. Alright, well, let's go ahead and grab the gun. Remember how this goes? Ah, good to see you remember the point of entry. Welcome to the targeting range. As you no doubt remember, cover is just as essential as aiming. You are currently in the cover position. You have two positions available to you. In cover and out of cover. You will only be able to fire when out of cover. To alternate between the two, tap the A and D keys. Oh wow. Good. Assume the out of cover position. It's like a combat system. Press space to fire. Good. Now try using up the rest of your ammo. As you can see, you will run out of ammo quite steadily in the field. Press R to reload your weapon. 
please note that you can only reload in the cover position. If this were a real scenario, you would be reloading with magazines. However, for this case, just press the little lever on the side of the weapon and the chamber will refill. Try shooting the target again after reloading. You might have noticed that shooting randomly while hitting the target often yields uneven results. Indeed. If you wish to aim for a one-shot, one-kill head blow, you must concentrate before firing. Try tapping control once to initiate a full breath. When breathing in, there is a zone that will flash, indicating you are set for a headshot. If you fire during this zone, you are guaranteed an instant kill. However, this is only a small window of opportunity, and you must use it wisely. Try it out on the target. Very good, but in the field, your enemies will not remain stationary for you. They will also duck in and out of cover. Try to score a headshot on the target while it moves in and out of position. Okay. Huh. This is kind of bizarre. Excellent. Very good, Delta 6. That will be all for today. Can I keep the gun? To change the difficulty of combat, access the menu, select options, and then click on combat. Please place the gun back on the pedestal. No. I'm not going to go around and shoot everything I see. Well, you know what? You are a buzzkill. Good. Now I suppose you don't remember why you are here anymore. This is a training facility where you are taught to become proper citizens again. As long as you follow orders, you will be out of this facility and back on the road to a normal life. Now, you see that ticket that just came out of the wall? These tickets are usually good for three meals. You can redeem them at the mess hall by inserting them into a dispenser. Go ahead and take it. Your food and well-being is up to you to take care of. John Spartan, you have been fined two credits. Alrighty. Can we open the grate? It's screwed in place. I'll need some kind of tool if I want to remove it. just as painful for you as it is for us. We have a tight schedule here, and we're on time limitations to get you and all of your friends rehabilitated. For all of our sakes, I hope I don't have to repeat myself again. Do I make myself clear? Crystal. Yes. Good, Delta-6. Now please exit the testing chamber. And we will leave with absolutely no uh, pre-programming or anything whatsoever. Of course not. Scanning for unauthorized testing apparatus. Ooh, there's a scan. So we need to be aware of that. Blue door. So we're in cell one. Can we open it? Cold to the touch. Not reacting to the hands. We've got another door here. Sign indicates that it's the maintenance door. Off limits to patients. Do 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 some kind of seal on it and can't get it open. Alright. Well, if we're going to get out of here, we need to get the lay of the land. And this must be the way to the mess hall. Checking to see if there's anything else. Just the cameras. 
Hey, you. Come over here, under the camera. You have a bullet hole in your head. Do you know who I am? No. No. Good. You have something on your sleeve that belongs to me. What are you- Ow! Good seeing you, Charlie. Charlie? She took a piece of cloth out of my hand. The one that had scribbles on it. Oh, she took the map. Awesome. Well then. Now we got red doors. Another maintenance door. Yellow door, green door. All right. Interesting. It's another maintenance door. We got elevators. What's in the box? I don't know what to do with it right now. All right, no nothing we can really do. Actually, I should probably check those other doors real quick, just in case. If any of these react to my hand. Hmm. Alright, well, let's try the elevator. I don't think it opens that way. I need to use the control. Oh. Of course. Oh, there's a plug up there. Ah, who forgot to reset the deflector shield again? Who is that? You, there, on level five. Oh, Delta Six. It's me, the director, once again. If you could be so kind as to figure out why the elevators have stopped working on that level, that would be great. That's the... Could it unplugged. Please? Well, because you said please. Yeah, the wire's not connected. So... I assume we use the box and push it this way. Do the shuffle. Got it. Thank you, Delta Six. I'll put in a word for you with the other instructors. That's nice. Who are you? And I thought, I was hoping that was going to be for the cameras, not the case. Alright. Interesting. So we're definitely being watched. Um... Can we look at our inventory? Okay, well... I forgot what button it was to look at our inventory. Where are we going? Maintenance, living, gym, mess hall, test chambers. So we're on level 5. Let's head down one level to the mess hall. I like the quick elevators. Whoa! For the ticket, buddy. It's got our lunch okay. money stolen. This is Delta Six. He must have had his memory wiped. Let's get out of here quick. Bad things are happening to Charlie today. They stole my ticket. They'd probably overpower me if I chased after them. Okay, so there's another secure door. And we can't. Well, let's just head this way then. Because we have no idea which direction they went. Hello, people. Quite literally. Full of useless remains. 
Oh, and it's all it's all quiet too. That's creepy. Hello. They greet me back with blank slates and meaningless stares. Hello. Is it the same thing all around? Staring glances and perplexed expressions. Maybe it's based on um the color they're wearing. Hello. Snarling faces and unwanted glares. All right, so green is angry. What about yellow? Hello. Empty souls and unwelcome glances. So, this is Hufflepuff. That's Slytherin. There's Ravenclaw. And there's Gryffindor. Makes perfect sense. This is the cafeteria. So it is. Hello. She looks like she knows me. I should sit down first. All right. Did you do it? Beg your pardon? Did you find out where we are? The map. What? You don't remember, do you? I... I don't know. My name is Epsilon 5. Your name is Charlie. Why do you call me that? You chose that name. I've called you that since you first saved me. You told me you were planning to have your memory erased again. They do that when you try to escape. What? You said it was to complete a map, to find out where we are. Why? Because we have to get out of here before the director... I know you don't remember anything, but you have to trust me. You took care of me when I got here, and now it's my turn to take care of you. Please, try to remember. I don't. Sorry. Here, have the rest of my food. It's like memento. I'll meet you tomorrow at my testing chamber. We... we usually walk back together. Okay? Okay. Remember, whatever you do, don't complete your final exam. Don't. And she's a Hufflepuff, and I'm a Ravenclaw. Tables are where we eat. Brilliant. Brilliant deduction. Thank you. We got grading for the ventilation. If I put a food ticket in it, it should dispense a meal. Well, I have no food ticket, unfortunately. Please insert your food ticket to redeem your meal. Sad days. Well, let's get back over here. Oh, that's creepy. Just everyone, just a, a, a quiet cafeteria. Ah, it's lights out. Yeah, are you guys... Nope. We got the gym, living, and maintenance. We can't go to the gym, I bet, so... We'll try going to the gym next. Okay, we, what is this? Metallic door. This must be the bathroom. Ah, male and female. A scanner? Nothing's happening. Of course. Because you have male genitalia. It's not reacting to my hands. Oh, it's a retinal scanner. I see. Oh, wow. So inviting. Delta 6, Alpha 6, Epsilon 7. More grading. Alrighty. Must control the force field. End of day 11. 
You have three tests remaining until your final exam and subsequent release. Good night. Lovely. Um, basin, toilet seat. It only has one button. Operations currently offline. And we can't use it. Wash your hands, that's good. Don't need to go now, good for you. But it is all we have, so. Think about your situation. There's something under my bed. It's a note. It reads, Delta 6. Don't trust anyone. Why is the L capitalized? The L-A. Okay. Don't trust anyone. DTA. 